Hello. Thank you for joining me again today. I'm so glad to see you. And if this is the first time you're coming to my channel, you're welcome. My name is Busola. Thank you for coming and I hope you come again and again. It has been said that you reap what you sow. <laughs> so better be mindful what you sow. Be sure it's what you want to reap. In my last video, I said to Aunt Ngozi that I would like to be like her when I grow up. And guess what? Today, someone says the same thing right back to me. That they would like to be like me when they grow up. So, mind what you sow. Because you're surely going to reap it. <laughs> Today, I'm going to bring those two people together. Professor Ngozi Elewechi Okike and Pastor Abiodun Adesanya. Not in that order. I asked one question to the two of them at different times. How old do you have to be to leave a legacy or to start thinking of leaving legacies? Or do you have to be very old before you start thinking of leaving legacies? Let's hear what each of them has to say. And as you watch, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, this is a good time to do so. Please click the subscribe button. And if you like what's going on, click like, show some love and share. Share with people you think would like it also. One more question. Thank you. You're not old. Mm -hmm. Sure. <laughs> Behind the screens, you're my junior cousin. <laughs> That's true. And some people think that living legacies is what you mm -hmm. think of doing when you're older. Can you speak about this? Okay. Is let me start from this. I, I still remain your junior brother anyway. <laughs> 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 and some of the some of the things you you actually taught us indirectly those days, directly or indirectly those days, actually also helped us to be what we are today and how mm. we how we are think. Yes. Thank I you. Remember when, when you come back from the from just then, and then <laughs> we were we were still secondary school boys, and and then the way you, you speak to us, you make us see life in a different way. And then we we thought that one day we'll grow up and be like you. Thank oh, you for that's a sweet <laughs> remembrance. <laughs> no, you, 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 you did. You really did. You, you might not remember, know the the impact those things did to us. Then you have no reason coming back to tell us about how good it is to be out there, and it really helped us. Talking about legacies, yeah. What do we not understand? What legacy is all about? Let's. This is about today. Legacy is about what is brother. Say it. Let's look about what is happening right now. And one thing we all need to understand is this, whatever you have to give today, if you don't give it out today, it may be relevant tomorrow. No one has, no one has a promise of tomorrow. That's true, the, that's true. That's the, another. Promise, the promise to we have is a promise of today. Yeah. How are we sure that even tomorrow exists in our own dictionary? We never know, but we have today and we can do the best of, 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 of what we have in today. So let's look around. Everyone should look around what they have. Whatever God has placed in your hand, whatever nature has given to you, that is what you need to put down to put down as a legacy. For some of us, it's education. For some of us, it's giving. Some of, some of us, is teaching. Some of us may not even have to give as in finances. Some of us may just have to give our time. Some of us need to just probably take two hours per day in the evening to say, look, I'm going to go to that old people's home. I'm going to give them support in there. Very some, of us, touch. Very. Yeah, some of us, some of us may just need to say, you know, my next, uh, I don't have time. I work. I'm uh, fine. You know, I just said, look, I'm going to be taking my lunch. Every lunch I have 30 minutes out of my, of my lunch. I need to, I'm going to use to cancel someone. So it's not all In about my, money. It's not all about money. There are so many ways you can support. There are loads of people that are hurting in the world today, not because of lack of funds. 
some of them are haunting because so no one is saying speaking to them, no one is saying the right thing to them. Some of them just need simple counsel. Some of them is just a direction. Some of them is just an opportunity to speak to someone. That's what they need. And some of them, some people actually need that support in terms of physical, physical time. Some people just need help as a friend. They need people to talk to. They need people to encourage them. And can we do something? Yes, we can. Everyone can do something. And Tingazi is always up and about for good causes. She goes about for good causes. Yes, and Tingazi. You just say that Bafa will be 15 years in March. Some people think that to go into this kind of work, you should wait until you are old. Please speak to people who think that uh, living, like thinking of living legacies is for old age, people who are maybe retired, people who are very old. What would you say to such people? To um, you don't have to be old to live a legacy. So what's the legacy? Something you leave behind that will continue to bless generation. Exactly, exactly. So you don't need to be old. Okay. So you can leave a legacy in so many ways. Once you see a need, all these charity ch charitable organizations we see yeah. everywhere. People re are responding to needs in the society. Yeah. And the, the needs keep increasing. We just need to open our eyes to see them. Yeah. Did you hear what I heard? Here and in the previous discussions both of them said the same things and in near similar words you don't have to be old to start thinking of living legacies start today and what you have is what is required you don't have to be rich i mean you don't have to be what you describe as rich give what you have and start giving it now is it a word of encouragement is it money practical help whatever you have to offer now is the best time to give it don't say tomorrow you have no promise of tomorrow and the person you want to help or the person who needs your help doesn't have the promise of tomorrow either so why not do it today why not give the help you can offer now legacy is now everyone can do something what you have is what is required legacy is a daily and a living thing thank you again for coming here today stay fine and i hope to see you in my next video till then Bye.